Georgia Bulldogs. Taking on the second ranked team in the land, the Ohio State Buckeyes. For EA Sports College Football, I'm Reese Davis, joined here in the booth as always by David Pollock and Jesse Palmer. Guys, let's tee this one up. Georgia about to kick it off to get us underway. And it'll be a touchback. The ball will come out to the 25-yard line. Offense set on first down. They'll come out on this drive and let it rip. And he dropped it. It looked for all the world like that would be a catch, and he just got too excited. And listen, I think the offense did a really good job isolating that running back on a linebacker, running the angle route, had him open. Running back's there. You got to make that play, man. Had a chance after the catch to do some damage. And he breaks into the open. They've got it to the 49-yard line, and they'll move the chains. And I love right out of the gate, this offense is going to be creative, and they're going to try to get their best players the football out in the open field. You saw it right there. On the ground, it's Henderson. Now, that's what you try to do as a defense. Limit those damages when they run the football. Get them on the ground, short gains, and to set your defense for positive situations down the road. Didn't get much on first down. It's second and nine. Dropping back, it's Howard. Getting some heat. And this sophomore able to wreak some havoc and get the sack. And how about that play by the free safety? You sort of got the feeling somebody's band was going to be playing after that one. Big gamble by the defense. Yeah, a great job timing it up and catching them off guard, bringing the blitz. It is. that You say that because I get it. It's high risk, high reward. That time, high reward getting the sack. All kinds of room to throw that one in there. Plenty of room on that play, and they find their way to the 36. And the Buckeyes are moving quickly down the field. The give to the back. And a good, solid pick up there before the defense knocks him down. Yeah, this coaching staff, they're getting this offensive line lathered up and into a rhythm. Now they're letting them drive off the ball on first down on these running plays, and they're getting chunks of yardage. Quarterback wants to throw on second down. A little screen to the running back. And into the end zone. Touchdown, Ohio State. Hauled it in and just kept right on running to the hallelujah land. They'll try to tack one more on their score. And with the extra point, they get the first seven of the game. They go 83 yards on the drive. And they cap things off with a scoring toss from 27 yards out. About to kick it off after punching it in for the touchdown. And he'll just take a knee, and this drive will start at the 25. The offense set for a first down play. They'll run it from the gun. And he surges up to the 36-yard line, and they'll move the chain. It's a good look and run, and I'll say this. I know George has always been known to run the football. They always want to be really physical, but it starts up front. They always seem to have great units on the offensive line, guys that communicate and guys that get pushed. And they put many running backs into the NFL, but it's because of these big old hog mollies up front. The offense lines up at the 41 with a first and 10. They'll give it to the back. We'll give him a couple on that with second and eight coming up. Georgia comes quickly to the line. Looking for room, it's Etienne. Using that running game to bludgeon forward, he's got four down to the 35. 
after the strong run on second down. Third down coming. Do they do it again? From the gun, wants to pass. Fires into traffic, it's picked off. He couldn't quite get loose on that return, but he'd already made the play, and they've got it at the 35. And this quarterback was having success throwing on the opening drive of the game, in large part because it's a lot harder to throw on third down when the defense is expecting it, like you saw right there. They were ready. Had a really good coverage call to get the INT. Here comes the Ohio State offense onto the field. That last drive, an absolute aerial assault for the touchdown, Jesse. It was a nice job in play calling, too, David, just giving the quarterback some easy looks and reads so he could go out and execute. And he knew exactly where to go with the football. Everything looked really, really easy. He was hot. The ball was coming out of his hands. The defense better do something different. Scanning the field, it's Howard. Throws to the tight end. Working on the right. And a big-time grab there. Knocked down immediately, but not before he gets it to the 40. Let's see if they can put the defense on its heels in first and 10. Fresh set of downs after the completion. Wants to throw on first down. Catch in the middle. It's Scott. Hard hitting tackle. I think that time offensively, you're just trying to take what the defense is giving you, right? They're playing zone coverage. You got your big fella just working right over the ball. It's an easy pitch and catch. Just take the profit and let's keep going. On second down, wants to throw it. They're trying to get to it. And he intercepts it. He couldn't quite get loose on that return, but he'd already made the play, and they've got it at the 35. Well, the defense came into this one knowing they needed to create takeaways to try to gain as much momentum as they could. Really nice interception on that play. Great job with the eyes by the defender there picking that up. They'll get him at the 45, but he got 10 on that one. Now a first down from the 45-yard line. And here we go. If you're an offense, you've got to get that ground game going so you can have some balance, and then you give it to your quarterback, Palmer, and let him make some plays down the field later on. Yeah, exactly. And coming into this game, this offense knew they were going to have to some way, somehow, at least establish a semblance of a running game for exactly what you just said. You've got to be able to use play-action pass later in this game. Can anyone catch him? He's there to make the stop, but not before he sets up this offense first and goal from the seven. I know it's early in the game, but defensively after that play, you know you have to tackle the catch. When this guy gets the ball in his hands, he is so dangerous after the fact. So it's okay for him to make catches. You just got to get him to the ground quickly. He pushes his way down to the four as they get closer and closer. See if they can get it done on second and goal. Tries again to get it in. And he takes it in for the score. Touchdown, Dogs! Ready to try the point after. Splits the uprights. A very efficient five-way scoring drive. And they finish it off with the score from the four. He'll call for the fair catch here. guys roll that offense back out there that last drive was promising for a while but you just can't mess it up at the end with the pick Jesse no you've got to be able to finish drives especially in this game if you're going to win and David they've got to be able to eliminate the mental mistakes yeah and I don't think you get conservative or play it safe you can trust your guy I think you put the ball right back in his hands and let him do his thing Cranking up a drive like that can really get you going. It's first down from the 44. He's looking to throw it. On the move to his left. Heaves it on the run. Throws it back across his body, and what do you think happened? Intercepted. At the 35, he's open. 
trying to take it back. And it's going to be a pick six. Touchdown, Georgia. The DB saw it. He thought, don't drop it, don't drop it. Then thought, don't get caught, don't get caught. And he did the pick six. Hey, these guys can play offense, too. Now, look at this. I show you, I can be a wide receiver. Coach might split them out at wide receiver next week after making that big play. But defense, great job making the interception. And you're right, doing something with it. Don't just slide down. Don't be content. Take that thing all the way back. Here comes the Ohio State offense onto the field. Well, the good news is they threw a touchdown pass last time. It was just to the wrong team, Jesse. Well, that's an unfortunate part of the game for quarterbacks. But guess what? They do happen. So you've got to be able to turn the... He had a chance to get rid of it and avoid the loss. Instead, the defense pushes him out of bounds for the loss. Just a really nice job defensively, too, not giving up on the play, right? You didn't sack him initially, but guys were still in hot pursuit and chasing. And this front seven defensively, they... And he is finding wide-open defenders all over the field. His third interception of the day. And with the interception, he'll take it all the way back. Touchdown, Bulldogs! Look, a lot of time left. There's a little bit of distance right now being put on the scoreboard. There is, but it's so awesome when you're a defense and you study all week about what's coming and what routes to be ready for, and then you jump the route and you...